The long wait is over. Unbroken Bonds is finally here. At last, the Unbroken Bond set is here. This is Fonzie, and welcome back to Pokemon Utopia. So today, I'm going to be opening an Elite Trainer Box from Unbroken Bonds that just released. I'm so excited to get this open. I'm sure everyone knows what the prize card is for this set. That Reshiram and Charizard GX Rainbow Rare. One of the most expensive cards right now. It's running for about 200 plus on eBay. We're going to see if we can pull it. But things aren't looking so good so far. I've seen a lot of videos of people opening packs. And um, unfortunately, it's really hard to pull. But before we continue, I want to share some exciting news with you guys. I just reached 50 subscribers. Yes. Finally, after such a long time of uploading, I'm just kidding. It's only been a couple of weeks, but I really appreciate all of you guys' support. Um, I hope you guys keep mashing that like button. Let's see if we can get this video to 15 likes. Uh, make sure to tell all your friends to subscribe and your family members. And to show a, a token of appreciation, I'm going to be giving away three booster packs. It's going to be two Team Up and one of the new Unbroken Bonds booster packs. All you have to do is comment down below what your favorite pokemon is and that's it just comment down below what your favorite pokemon is uh, make sure you're subscribed and you'll be entered into the raffle to win these three booster packs so now that we got that out the way let's go ahead and open this elite trainer unbroken bonds pack now if you guys uh don't know what an elite trainer box is it comes with eight booster packs uh it comes with some energies some sleeves uh, i think this is the play map no wait no sorry this is the player's guide it's gonna flip through that really quick Ooh, that's some nice artwork there um but yeah just the player's guide telling you how to how to play the actual game that's some nice lovely artwork in the back keep that for later and here is the main event the actual unbroken box itself slide that out all right let's get right into it so here are the eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight Unbroken Bonds booster packs. I can't wait to get those open. But before we get to that, let's see what other goodies we have in here. So we have a GX tag team. Tag team? Why isn't it the uh, Unbroken Bonds? That's weird. Huh. <laughs> no, no, All right. No. I already have one of those. I opened it from, I uh, forgot where I opened it from, but it comes with a poison marker and a burn marker. That's weird that it's the tag team. Oh, oh man, look at that. It's the Reshiram and uh, Charizard uh, sleeves. Those are looking nice. I'm gonna keep those in there. I'm gonna save those for another occasion. Um, I'm not gonna open this, uh, but this is just pretty much the um, the energies. It has a bunch of energies inside. I'm not gonna open it because it, it's not necessary. I'm sure everyone knows what, what's in there. Um, oh, there's some uh, code card here of some sorts. Not sure what that unlocks, but hey, if you get that code card, let me know and see what you get. And it comes with some uh, dividers here. If you want to go ahead and put your cards all in a stack, um, they recommend that you put the cards in here and you can like divide them with this between Pokemon, energy supporters and things like that. So let's go ahead and get all of that out the way. Make sure that every, everyone is ready for the main event. These packs right here. This is what everybody wants to see. Oh, uh, I almost forgot. Comes with some dice as well here. Um, so whenever you have to roll, I think, uh, where is the, yeah, it comes, see the, the one here, it's like a little fire symbol. I thought that was pretty cool. All right. And all right. What should we start with first? What do we have here? We have one Gardevoir and Sylveon, uh, Reshiram and Charizard, Marshadow and Machamp, Melmetal and Lucario. Do we have two of each? We do. Cool. All right. Let's go ahead and start off with the fairies. Let's start off with, uh, Gardevoir and Sylveon. And uh, if you guys can just do your part, please, and go ahead and mash that like button. Let's see if we can go ahead and get a 15 likes on this video. I would really appreciate it. It helps me out a lot. Here is the code card, guys. And here we go. First pack of Unbroken Bonds. Oh, man. Oh, whoa, whoa a minute. There is some damage here. Oh, does, do you guys see this? There's a lot of damage on that end. Oh, don't tell me this was a... Uh, oh, boy. This is unfortunate. This is unfortunate. I hope... Oh man, I hope we don't have uh, too much, too good of a card in here. Okay, so we're gonna start with Coughing, Alolan Diglett, Zubat, Jigglypuff, Bellsprout. Whoa, did I do the card trick wrong? 
I thought it was a uh, four from the back. Coughing and Meowstic is the rare. Was I not paying attention to that? It's a fairy, energy, pharaoh, charge bug. Oh, this has a really good ability. It's uh, once during your turn, before you attack, you may attach this card from your hand to one of your Vicovo or Vicovo GX as a special energy card. This card provides two lightning energies only while attached to a Pokemon. That is insane. And Pyukumuku. Oh, I like the, it's like a crocheted or knitted uh, Pokemon. Um, hmm, I'm gonna have to pay attention to the, to the order there. Uh, man, I don't know what that damage was though. I hope, I hope all these cards are not damaged. I would, I would hate to have a damaged card. Oh boy, let's just hope it was that one. I think, I think it was just that one though. Here's the, here's the code card for you guys. Let me get that out the way. So I'm not gonna do the card trick on this one. I'm gonna pay attention and see what that was about. So we have Poliwag, Spritzy, Lickitung, Venonet, Sparrow, uh, Janine. Ooh, that's a good one. Janine Reverse and a Butterfree with Triple Charge and Solar Beam. So it looks like it's, uh, oh, it's five and six. Okay, so they changed it. Okay, uh, Water Energy, Dust Island, Go Bats, and Tentacruel. All right, so um, I know that the that the pool rates are pretty hard. I mean, seeing a lot of videos, and uh, it's kind of hard to get good cards. I mean, I saw that Darium opened 3,000 packs and did not get a single Charge RGX Rainbow. So that card is going to be really, really hard to get. Oh, I did four again. Hold on, guys. Let me see if I can redo that. It's one, two, three, four, five? Is it five? Oh man, I don't know if I messed it up again. It's not five. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five. So it's one, two, three. Is it three? I'm gonna have to redo this and see. I think it's I think it's four. I don't know. I'm just gonna go with four. Alright, so we have lightning energy, stealthy hood, a penny. Oh welder, this is a good card. Um, attach up to two fire energy cards from your hand to one of your Pokemon if you do draw three cards. That is insane. I'm going to keep that right here because that's going to be really good in any type of fire deck. Froakie, Aaron, Seal, Bellsprout, uh, Ghastly. Oh, nice. A Reverse Rhyperior, which is a rare. And, oh, a Holographic Mew. That's what I'm talking about. All right. So this Mew is actually pretty good. Um, it has the ability Bench Barrier. Prevent all damage done to your bench Pokemon by your opponent's attack. That is insane. I think that card is going for, uh, for a good amount of money as well. All right. So let's see. Let's go ahead and start off with uh, with this Lucario. Hopefully we can go ahead and get something good from, uh, from this one. Oh, boy. I don't know what that was about, though. This is weird. I got the Code Card trick wrong. Uh, some of the cards are damaged. This is... Uh, this is this is pretty odd, guys. All right, so here's the code card. Uh, one, two, three, four. Let me do it from, from the back. See, this one's normal. Oh, that's weird. Okay, uh, Metal Energy, Hitmontop, Gliscor, Frogadier, Radata, Godin, Alolan Diglett, Slowpoke, Lidden, a Reverse Pyukumuku, and a Blacephalon, Ultra Beast. Uh, just a rare. Oh, I thought that was... Uh, I thought that was going to be a holographic, but it's not. Man, um, they are not kidding about the pools. I mean, I know I'm only a couple packs in, but uh, we got, what, the, the one hollow, the, the Mew itself? Hopefully we can get better luck. I know uh, Snorlax wants some unbroken Bonds apples. I'm I'm with you there, buddy. Go ahead. Oh, get the code card. Let me get to focus. Can you focus for me? There we go. Okay. All right. So we have uh, Darkness Energy. Dodrio, Raticate, Weeping Bell, Radata, Godin, Darumaka, Sandile, Salandite, Venonet, and a Licky Licky. Well, you gotta keep on moving. I'm trying to go for that quest of better cards and more holographics. Oh, and again, guys, if you can, you guys can just go ahead and subscribe to, uh, not subscribe, but follow me on Twitter. Um, every Wednesday, I'll be doing a code card giveaway, which I will be giving away unbroken bonds um, packs or not packs, but the code cards. So if you guys are interested in that, follow me on Twitter at Pokemon Utopia One. Uh, Rhyhorn, Growlithe, Cubone, 
a reverse Porygon, and a Sand Slash. Oh boy, guys. We are not doing so good. We're down to the last two packs. Uh, Reshiram and Charizard. Things are not looking too good at all. I, I, again, I did hear that the pool rates were, um, were pretty insane in this. I mean, not too many good pools. But, uh, wow, I, I did not think it was going to be this difficult for me. I thought I was going to get a little bit more lucky. Um, all right, so we got a Water Energy, Haunter, Krokorok, uh, Beast Bringer. That's a really good one. Um, if you have exactly six prize cards remaining, and if your opponent's active Pokemon GX or Pokemon EX is knocked out by damage from an attack of the Ultra Beast, this card is attached to take one more prize card. So it's pretty good in, in the late run. If you're down late in the game, it could potentially get you a little bit closer to that win. We got Squirtle, Rhyhorn, a Reverse Ghastly, and a Quagsire. Wow, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. We're seven packs in. We got one pack to go, and we only have one holographic, which is the Mew. This is insane. This is insane how hard it is to pull something. Um, okay, so here's the code card, and come on, guys. Let's go out with a bang. Come on, last pack. Let's get some last pack magic. Let me, uh, let me go ahead and blow on it for some good luck. All right. Here we go, guys. Darkness energy. Welder again. Good card. Uh, Haunter, Krokorok, Sandile, Salandite, Coughing, Alolan Diglett, Zubat. Whoa, that's a good reverse. Triple acceleration energy. Wow, that looks amazing. This is really good. This is um, this is like a repro of boost energy from back in the day, except that it's way better because you don't have to discard it at the end of the turn. Boost energy, you could attach it to a Pokemon, but you would have to discard it at the end you do not have to discard this card. Other, the only reason you discard this card if it's attached to a Pokemon that's not a, that's not a basic. And, oh, there we go, Landorus. That's a holographic right there. Another apple for, uh, for Snorlax. Wow, well, man, guys, that was, that was tough. I don't really know what to say about that. Um, all we got was, uh, was a Mew, which is a good card, and uh, Landorus, but that's it. That's, that's all we have to show for eight packs. I mean, in eight packs, that's all we were able to pull. It just goes to show how insane these pull rates are for these for this actual booster packs. Um, this set is enormous. It's 234 cards, and who's gonna be a while for me to go ahead and collect all of them? I don't even know I'm gonna be able to collect all of them. Um, if you guys can just make sure to subscribe, like this video, um, go ahead and share it with your family members. Uh, again, follow me at Pokemon Utopia One on Twitter. Um, I hope you guys get way better pools than I did, but don't worry. I have many more videos coming of me opening more packs. So hopefully you're able to get something good. Other than that, I just want to thank you guys for watching. And until next time, Snorlax stays hungry.